Hey everyone! So for this unboxing, I'm just gonna open one package that I got from Hot Topic and I think I have an idea of what it is because I do get confused with Hot Topic and Box Lunch because they do, um, well, Box Lunch is owned by Hot Topic so that's why I was kind of iffy on what this was um, because I've been ordering a bunch of mystery boxes as well as stuff from the Comic Con that passed this weekend. So um, I think this is... I think this is what I think it is but yeah let me just see because I do want to unbox the Comic Con stuff um, all together in one video but I did pick up one pop from Hot Topic that was from the Comic Con um, ex shared exclusives as well so once I get one more package then I'll be able to do a combined video for my Comic Con hauls which isn't that many I only bought I ended up buying four. I originally wanted to get two, but I ended up getting four. So anyway, so I'm just going to do a quick unboxing of this package. So um, it did come a bit damaged on the side, like a little squished here. But um, I feel like this is a really big box for the one thing that I got from them. So I'm hoping that it came securely. Oh, okay, this is definitely not the pop that I was thinking of, but it is one of the Hot Topic pops that I really wanted to get, but I missed out on it because, um, well, I missed out on the on it when, like, it was released in stores, but I did take the chance to order it online because I knew for sure once I get to the stores during my lunch break that it would be absolutely gone because, um, two different stores are near me um, Hot Topic they usually sell out within the first 20 minutes or so of opening up their stores so yeah so I'm, I'm glad I snagged this one while I could online but I'm not too sure how um, good value it or good value good condition it would be in because I know there's always been trouble with shipping per se um, but yeah so so let's show you what it is and bam! It's Diamond Collection Baymax! So um, this is actually my second Diamond Collection figure. The first one that I got was actually the Jack Splunkton one that just came out. Um, so yeah, this one actually looks like it came in really good condition. I do have a regular Baymax version, but um, back then when I wasn't really into um, Funko Pop collecting, I actually kept them out of the box, and I actually tossed the box. I don't know what um, some of you guys that actually do out-of-box collections, I'm not sure if you keep the boxes or so, but I was just like, oh man, well I don't really need the box because this this big guy is going to be out of the box, but I kind of wish that I had kept him in the box because he did end up getting like a little bit dirty because he is a white colored um, Funko Pop. But yeah, so when this came out, I was really excited because this would give me an opportunity to actually be um, a more legit, I guess, Funko Pop collector that does in the box. So I'm really glad that he came in good condition. Here is the front, the side. Then the back of the box, so I guess this is part of um, the series. So yeah, I had him. I actually bought this guy for um, my best friend. So she had him out of the box as well. And again, um, this was back when we weren't like hardcore Funko Pop collector collectors. Um, so we kept our Funko Pops like out of the box. Um, but yeah, so I'm really glad that I was able to snag this one because they had run out of him at the Hot Topics near by my work, but I did eventually see him in stores around um, where I live, but it would only be like maybe one of them or maybe two at the most. But yeah, I was I was glad that I was able to have the option to have it shipped to me. So yeah, so this is basically what came in my big Hot Topic box. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure that you press the like button. Also make sure that you subscribe to my channel for more unboxings and other cool videos I have posted on there. And yeah, so thanks for watching. Bye!